Well, the whole school saw it. Now the principal tonight is apologizing after getting a lot of complaints that it was sexist and also that it sent the wrong message to students. New at 10 o'clock, Marianne Martinez at Flower Mounds Marcus High School tonight for us. Marianne? Well, Doug, that controversial video is one of two videos students saw on the second day of school regarding the dress code. The first was pretty generic, just what to wear and what not to wear. Go ahead and take a look at part of the second one. Live fast, die young, bad girls do it well. Live fast, die young, bad girls do it well. Live fast, die young, bad girls. Do it well. Okay, ladies, follow me. The girls are taken to a dress code violators room filled with only other girls. Repeat after me. I will not wear athletic shorts. The first thing that really hit me was the song. I'm, I've seen boys who wear tank tops. I've seen boys whose pants are sagging and showing their underwear band. And that's also not in dress code, but that wasn't addressed even once. In a letter to parents, Principal Will Skelton explained that a fashion show that demonstrates what to wear and what not to wear didn't happen. Quote, we believed a video would be a good way to replace the fashion show, but this video absolutely missed the mark. In Katherine Mooring's eyes, the video shows a double standard in the student dress code and how society treats men and women. We should be more educated on women's rights. We should be more educated on sexualization and rape culture because that's what all of this really boils down to is that somewhere a group of people agreed that this was okay to show and there wasn't one person who said, you know, maybe we shouldn't do this. The principal also told parents, I'm a firm believer that when you make a mistake, you own it, you apologize, and you make it right. Now, we're also told tonight that the principal has met with some of the young women at the school who were offended by the video. The students say they are very happy that the student, or rather, that the principal has been open to listening to them and they feel he has taken ownership for what has happened. Reporting live from Flower Mound, Marianne Martinez, CBS 11 News.